So hey, you were back in Elder Jim's. Um, I keep think I keep thinking Jungle Jim. I'm sorry, I can't help it. We're back in his jungle. He's just showed us some temples. Uh, the last recording, yeah, we had some technical bits, but there's just too much that's too pretty. So I, rather than start over, I just quit and we went into part two. So we are going to go on from here. Elder Jim, I seem to be functioning again. So please lead on. As I said earlier, we've got a, a, a preview that I set up of uh, chiseled blocks, dirt, glass, and cobblestone. Lovely. Because I've been wanting to actually have a look at some of these myself. I've not had a chance to even look at them. So, look at all the choices. Oh, the glass. I just love it. The Chinese, the, the wooden, yeah. There's a creeper. <laughs> there yes, is. there is. There is. And we'll go from around the back of the temple, across the way, and we'll go up the windy way up uh, to my portal. Okay, where's that? I'm trying to find your name. Over there. Okay. Us coming. The windy way up. That sounds like fun. Cow pig, you can get pushed over. Okay, so we actually came in through here the first time. Uh, we saw the cotton over there and we went up into, oh no, we came from over there someplace, off to that area, right? Okay. Yes, off to your right, where the pig's coming out. Um, I made my own waterfalls and I'm going to get a, uh, all this cliffside here I'm going to add flowers to every flat place I can nice <laughs> it's a good place for a waterfall you come out in the morning with your cup of tea in the hand and you go oh looky there I even made a little bit of a water spout over here made out of cobblestone oh just off to the left there isn't that pretty so it's just flowing overhead I like it And then I had another idea of um, what you'd find in the jungle. So I made this little odd thing off to the left-hand side when you come through. And I'm bending my head trying to peek around to see. <laughs> Love the cobblestone walkway here or whatever you call this. It's just beautiful. Oh, I keep trying. Okay. You guys go ahead. I need to be out of your brains so I can. There we go. Oh, look at this. Yeah, that is the kind of thing you'd find in... Either, you know, a temple in the jungle or, you know, in Lord of the Rings or some, you know, Indiana Jones. Absolutely. I got to hang on a second. I have to go back and have a look at something just a little quick. No, no, I'm not chasing you. <laughs> I'm just going to run by real fast. You know, I love this sense of adventure. You kind of peek down through the vines. And look at this. Just look at that. So nice. I borrowed the idea from you when we did the water uh, park, and I did curvy little stairways up through the this terrain. Oh, this is so nice. I love it. You feel like you're following the trail that, you know, and the vines all over that you're walking through, and this is just too beautiful. Oh my gosh, that's pretty. Look at this. <laughs> there may or may not be a ball court down there later. Yeah. You mean like the, the traditional Mayan ball court? Exactly. It don't sound terrible. We're back up where we started and we're going to go down kind of a windy way through the trees. So now let's take a look from the top first. Oh yeah, we did start up here somehow. Okay. Here's a good spot. Oh. Look at Maybe that. Maybe just a little <laughs> further. That's so pretty. I've seen it, so I'll get out of everybody's brains. <laughs> 
Okay, yeah, I can. You know what? I can fly. I can, yes, I can. I'm gonna say, can I still fly? Look at that. Just peering through the jungle. He has left the trees. He's left the vines. You know, and if you were hiking through here, oh God, can you imagine? I don't know if any of you guys have played Minecraft long enough to create a road through the jungle, but it's a bloody job. But imagine coming up through that and then down here through the bush somewhere all the vines and the trees you'd be seeing little glimpses of that coming through yeah exactly yeah. my idea yeah. exactly oh, this is heaven look at that wouldn't it just take your breath away <laughs> i'm gonna go down to where you are kind of sort of and try not to die i can tp you here <laughs> i'm good vine save your life And so does landing in water. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, this is special. Head up to the, the front door, sort of. The original idea was just to make the temple, and then I decided I needed to do something on the inside. Let's go to the top first. Okay, lead on. Chiseled stone snakes are cool. Boy, this chisel thing was just perfect for you, wasn't it? Especially since I could take unmined uh, stone and get mossy stone. Yeah, I love that part so much. Mossy stone is my favorite block, and those little cobblestone things you've got on your walkway I keep wanting to try those over the mossy cobble you just I don't know it might look like crap but I have to try them because I just keep thinking about it look at this uh, do you need to do some more mining and get some lapis for lapis blocks I think I could chisel them I don't have one with me but that's all right and I did some chiseled gold blocks to the top I noticed from down below, I saw them glinting on top. Look at that. I'm going to have a little room uh, around the, here for beds for people if they don't want to try to get through the jungle during the dark. Uh, we'll see. It's like a visitor center. <laughs> this is incredible. Oops. You got to go back to the stair. I got to go back to the stairs. Oh, look at this. Okay, got, oh, that's another thing. We've got a few online today, and hopefully other people on the server will be watching these. I want to start doing uh, shots for the calendar. I really, really do want a calendar of your work this year. We only have 12 pages. I don't know if I will, you know, play around with Photoshop and try to get more than one thing per, or if I will just grab a collection and put them online you know, somewhere just for us in the Ray Call or, or whatever, and or our Skype group, and have you guys vote on which 12 end up going in. But uh, I want to start taking pictures for the calendar, because, oh my goodness, that'd be so fun. Love it. Yeah. And then we'll see, you know, it'll be just a, like a waypoint for next year. We'll sit back and go, oh, we thought that was great, and that was great, and oh my gosh, look what's happened this year. So, yeah. so in here, it's a little cramped for now. I haven't really worked on it much. Uh, like I said, if you get all the way up to the top of the temple and realize that the mobs are spawning, this will be a safe haven. I'm not sure where you're around. Oh, you're around back. Oh, looky here. You have a spot. Oh, my goodness. No kidding. Nice. And I need nice. to work on the floor a bit. That's an awesome floor. I love it. Left a tree. You built around the tree? Yes, I did. I love these people. <laughs> Put some doors in it, make it safe, throw uh, some furniture in here. Maybe work on the ceiling a bit. Uh, I don't know how, how much higher I can go, maybe one block. Well, you know, you're supposed to be down in a tomb. You know, having it feel kind of like you're in a tomb is not a bad thing. We're going to go down to the middle of the tomb right now. Why am I worried? 
about out. It's nice. I made two side entrances that kind of blend in with everything and aren't too obtrusive. I never even noticed them going up. You did good. And here we are inside. You can see the pattern from above. That's the bottom of the room we were in last. Oh man, is that just dirt blocks that you've cut? You've chiseled. Exactly. You've chiseled. What a great bloody ceiling! Oh. I tried to keep the back wall kind of flat, and then I decided to add a bit of a, a templish look, and it's going to go into a future grotto. Matter of fact, when you were doing uh, the earlier videos, I was hauling water up through here. <laughs> Eventually, I'm going to take this back wall and open it into a very large open area, underground, light it, throw plants down through here, see what happens. Nice. That's just about it. We'll take the one last little trip. It's a hallway that goes down to the like a common area of all the paths. Not so random. Still looks nice. I've got a little bit of a build area over here. And not much to look at, but it, it's I, I did a whole random brick on the inside here. Okay, the utility area. Yeah, we've all got lots exactly. of notes. Lots of notes. <laughs> exactly. Back up. Need a door on the other side, it doesn't go anywhere, but I wanted the <laughs> symmetry. <laughs> Just wanted to see if I was going to snoop, didn't you? <laughs> well, not a problem. I was expecting people to open it. Uh, the bricks on the top are, well, chiseled stone, and it's called poison pattern. Looks good. Crappy name. Yeah. Uh, unworked yet. And then we're back pretty much where we started. You know your way around through all of this. I'm, I'm lost. Oh, look. Look where we are. We're exactly where we started. Tried it's to keep them... It's pretty close to each other yes it's all connected you're going through these hallways like you're climbing through the jungle and you're going up the side of a hill and then you end up just this is amazing how you ever path this out like how did you know when you're way over there that you can build a t you know a tunnel and come out right here you have a good eye, for a good eye for to be honest I was a few blocks off it took a lot of backfill uh, and redo <laughs> but I, I finally got it together Ah, oh, Jim, this is outstanding. This is just so beautiful. And it's a completely it's new complete. style. Like, we've got nothing like this. Like, this is just, it was needed. You know, we uh, Zen is starting to work on a lot of Oriental stuff, thank goodness. And as soon as I get a chance to get over there and see what he'll let me show off, we'll look at that. But I love it. I love all the history that's here. And there's a lot of different kinds of history we've been missing. So this is beautiful. It's just beautiful. So. I definitely wanted to look at that as, as a painting, as a, a piece of art to fit into the terrain. And it does. It feels like it's just growing right up out of the jungle. And that's that's what I like best about it. Or the jungle has taken back over, you know, some of some of it. Like it's, yeah. Future plans, I'm going to make a, a more disordered, uh, collapsed temple in part of another part of the uh, forest. Oh, wonderful. Yeah. Oh. 
you know, people are talking earlier about solar power. I might build a temple to the sun and have more mechanical things there. Still sounding good. If the factories look like this, build all you want. <laughs> Oh my god, so thank you heaps and heaps. I'm going to call this quits. I just saw the time. We've got some things I have to do. And we are recording uh, a group thing later tonight. So i got to get gone and get out of here. Ooh, don't go crazy. And um, so, until I see you next time, do leave your comments. Hit the like button. Subscribe if you haven't. And if you are a longtime subscriber, thanks for sticking around. Thanks for being part of the pack. Until I see you next time, live your life happy. And build it like Jim. Bye-bye.